Modeling is a process that uses math to represent, analyze, make predictions, or otherwise provide insight into real-world phenomena. Now that you've created and proved a useful, efficient mathematical model, the final step in the process is simple. Explain it. Your model may provide impressive results, but no one will ever know unless you can report your findings. We use the paper as a way of looking at our progress and knowing where we were at each step. We found it useful to start the paper from the beginning and keep working on it. Your report should explain your process in detail, beginning with a summary, a one-page overview that states the problem you were solving, your methods, and results and conclusions. It should be free of technical jargon. In our executive summary, we summarize the process and other solutions and other steps. You will also want a formal introduction that restates the real-world application. Be sure to include the motivation for looking at the problem, your problem statement, and your general approach. As a hint, many top modelers write their summaries and their formal introductions at the end of the process. The body of your paper should explain your assumptions, variables, the model, the solution, and your analysis. Finally, your conclusion analyzes your results, discusses the model's strengths, weaknesses, and areas that could be improved. Here are a few tips to help you write the report. Take good notes while you're going through the modeling process. Follow all technical writing procedures. Use proper grammar. Label all of your figures appropriately. Show units and any relationships between variables. It's essential to justify all of your assumptions and cite all of your sources. Give yourself enough time to write and proofread your paper. And finally, pat yourself on the back. You've created a thoughtful and meaningful piece of work. We've been doing math since we were first in school, really, but now we finally get a chance to take all the things that we've learned over these past 12 or so years and actually apply it to real-world problems. Instead of just doing problems on a board or in a paper that are just kind of abstract, now we can actually put pen to paper and get data that could actually help people, save people money, time, energy. So that's what I like about it. It actually matters for once. For more information on mathematical modeling, log on to m3challenge.siam.org.